Hi, my name is John Dean with Dean Safe Company, and I want to introduce you to this electronic lock. It's called the ESL10. It's made by AMSEC or American Security Products. It's a very good lock. It's a high security lock. I want to show you how easy it is to open it. I want to show you how easy it is to change the combination and how easy it is to change the batteries. We get a lot of calls on this. It's really easy. So let me show you. To open the safe, you hit clear. And I have the existing combination as one, two, three, four, five, six. You hit the pound and you're in the safe. Let me show you how easy it is to change the combination. The first thing you've got to do with all electronic locks is open up the door and throw the bolts out. That way, even if you screw it up, you don't really screw it up. So the first thing we do with the keypad is we hit the C and the pound. We put in our existing combination, which I have preset to one, two, three, four, five, six, and we hit the pound again. Now, we're going to put in our new combination two times. I'm going to go six, five, four, three, two, one, pound. Six, five, four, three, two, one, pound. And there we've got a long warble. What's that telling us? It tells us it works great. Okay. Now, let's check it. We're locked. We'll try the old combination. One, oops, clear. One, two, three, four, five, six, pound. Okay, I got four beeps. That means that's the incorrect combination. It washed that out of its memory. Now we hit clear. Six, five, four, three, two, one, pound. We're ready to go. We're unlocked. Now let me show you how to change the batteries. This particular lock, you turn it to the left about 20 degrees and it comes right off and you have two 9 volt batteries. It only likes alkaline batteries. You just unsnap the batteries, put them in, and just put the unit right back on where it was. It's just that easy. Now, even when the batteries are dead, the existing combination is frozen in there and it lasts for years and years and years, so don't worry about that. If you uh, go away to Europe for a year and you come back, your batteries are dead, get two brand new alkalines, slam them in here, and you're going to be just fine. So you've got a high security lock, you're the only person in the whole world that knows how to do it. And by the way, it, when I put the wrong code in, and one of the reasons these locks are so good, if you put the wrong code in four times in a row, you get a lockout penalty. So it just takes forever to try and manipulate these electronic locks. Uh, dial lock, not much of a problem. The electronic locks are way ahead of them. That's why these are considered a high security lock. Anyway, ESL 10 by American Security Products. Thank you. Watch the video again if you didn't pick it up the first time. Thanks.